All right, the playoff finale is finally here, and round one of the Tour Championship did not disappoint from East Lake. I have to start things off with some of the best shots of the day because there were a lot of them. First, Phil on the first, putting from 95 feet off the green, and it was looking pretty good. And look at that smile. Phil loves it, and the crowd, of course, loves Phil. Siwoo Kim wrapped his roundup in dramatic fashion on 18, and he leads the tour in most pullouts this season. One of many ways to make birdie at this 18th. Now, Patrick Reed won the Barclays, and he <laughs> was my pick this week. Unfortunately, he is three over through the first round, but hey, I haven't lost hope because of shots like that on 14. And this was kind of a TBT. Jordan Spieth wearing a green shirt, pulling out from a bunker. Kind of looks like the John Deere Classic in 2013 when he got his first win on tour, and the defending champ is at two under. Yes, the top 30 definitely came to play, and we have a three-way tie at the top of the leaderboard. Hideki Matsuyama, Kevin Chappell, and Dustin Johnson all got it to four under on Thursday. Chappie got in on the fun, holding out from the second. Why not get it off to a fast start? How about this? And DJ's walk-off birdie on 18 got him to the top, so looks like he's not quite ready to give up his top spot in the FedEx Cup standings quite yet. Kevin Chappell is not the only Kevin doing big things this week in Eastlake, and our own Taryn Schaefer is on site all week in Atlanta, and she caught up with the hometown Kevin. Thanks, Kelly. Kevin Kisner definitely feels at home here at Eastlake. The three-time All-American at the University of Georgia came in at three under on Thursday, and he feels at home in Georgia every time he plays. He says he won earlier this year at the RSM Classic in Sea Island, Georgia, and on Thursday heard plenty of go dogs from the fans. Tons of Georgia people around this neighborhood, and uh, it's always fun to come back kind of what feels like home. You know, I spent a lot of my life here, and. Uh, it's exciting to play well in front of my, uh, my people. Now, Kisner is not the only one in the field this week that feels right at home here in Atlanta because we have several guys in the field that went to Georgia Tech, and Roberto Castro actually lives right here in Atlanta. Back to you. All right, thanks, Taryn. That'll do it for The Takeaway. Make sure to tune into PGA Tour Live starting Friday morning at 10 a.m. for exclusive second-round coverage, and I will see you right back here Friday night for a brand-new Takeaway.